Hi everyone, hello and welcome to Happy Wednesday Dollar Tree Haul. I am here, we are back together, and I am always so grateful, thankful, and blessed to be here with every single one of you. I hope you all have had the most amazing couple of days since I saw you last on Happy Monday Dollar Tree Haul. Can't wait to jump in, share, and show you all the great things that I found over the last few, so I do want to do that now. Every single thing in this haul costs $1.25 a piece, so I love that information for you guys right there. Now let's hit it. I'm super pumped about it. Look at what I found, and look at the size on these containers right here so I am so stoked and excited for organization yes I am this is sure fresh reusable this is a cereal container it says but I'm gonna put everything in these um this is 16 cups 128 fluid ounces and it's plastic it's really big great tall size it will fit in my cabinets so just so that you know you can see this is a very large container so you'd have to check if they fit in yours as well but I'm also going to put the cereal inside of these for the top of the refrigerator you know to contain them because that's usually where I keep my cereal anyways has this great little pop lid right on the top it comes off really easily with these little tabs right here that you just pull up on and I think that they're fantastic use them for whatever you would like for storage reasons and I'm pretty happy about it and I got five of them so I am looking for more but I did leave two behind so that somebody else could have them and I hope I can find more throughout the other stores as I'm shopping because everything is going to go inside of those then then I found these and um, I'm pretty excited. These say 125 right on the tag. I've never seen them before or seen that tag. So this is Simple Kitchen Mini Mitt. That's what it says. Poly Cotton Wash Cold, it says. Tumble Dry Low. Wash Colors Separately. Um, use only non-chlorine do not bleach. So that is the directions that is on this particular tag. And then it has this great lining inside so that you don't burn yourself and it feels like really good quality. So I'm super excited for the patterns. I did leave two other patterns and colors behind, but I picked up all the cutest ones that my eyes loved. So there is that one. Then we also have this really great one. This is nice, happy, bright springtime looking, and I think it's so phenomenal and fantastic. And also these are pretty for my eyes, but the guys are going to use these out and I'm sure that they won't stay pretty for so long. They do way more cooking in the kitchen than I do and so this one right here I like the muted colors I love the gray and white look to it I love the quilted look and everything else and they're so nice so here are the little loops on them as well all three of them have it so that you can hang them up from whatever space you would dangle these from so there is that and that's so exciting to me i love new kitchen stuff the guys work really hard in there and so they can have nice things and um then it's really helpful for them as well so here we go with some amazing mugs and these almost look like they're pottery you know like somebody actually made these from clay so on the bottom it says microwave safe dishwasher safe they're such a pretty texture and they just feel really expensive, to be honest with you. Look at all the speckles within like the lining of the paint and stuff. I love this one. It kind of looks like a roadway all the way around it. So it's really super duper cute and such a great style. So I'm going to give that one to Richie because he's always on the road to work. So I think that would be cute for him. And then I found it in this pattern also. Very, very aztec -y, you know, kind of boho style. And I think it's really pretty. All of them are around the same tone of that little off-white with the speckles all throughout it. And they're just a really, really exceptionally nice looking mug. So I was pretty happy about this. And I like the cool tones. So here is this one. This is the third one I found. So I scooped de duped this one right up. And I think I'm going to give this one to Cindy. So really such a pretty pattern on it. And you can feel the divots in it as you can look at the um, print on it. You can feel all the lines moving and grooving in every different direction. So I love that about the mugs as well. You know, when you're holding a mug, you kind of just running your hands over it with a warm beverage inside. And so that's a nice texture. And I really appreciate that feature. So I found this great cork board 
and I love the octagon style of it. Is it octagon? I hope I'm saying that right. I do believe that that's octagon. I hope I'm getting that correct. Um, this is Corner Office by Jot Cork Bulletin Board. And this is a 10 inch. So that's really, really good. It's a nice size. And for all those sticky notes that I purchased and hauled for you guys on Happy Monday Dollar Tree Haul, this is going to be a great board for me to pin them to. So what I really liked is that they came with some push pins inside of it which I thought was really great, but we can also purchase more from the Dollar Tree as well. Has this string right here, this actual like cording type of rope that will be able to hang it up. And in an office space, or I'm going to put this in the kitchen by the refrigerator, I can hang up all of my note taking needs so that I can remember what I'm doing each day because there are so many things every day. Um, also, I found some great, beautiful, stylish, gorgeous little decoration pieces, some wall hangings. I love, I absolutely love the shape of this. This says, a house is made of walls and beams. A home is made of love and dreams. And then it has the greenery right on it I'd probably just put something really cute over where you can see the staple to hide it maybe like a little twine bow or something like that but look at how nice that is the quality of it the shape of it the design they did such a fantastic job and the saying is really really beautiful so loved that extra much and then this one as well same exact shape but I love the colors of this one too where it's a little bit darker on the wood grain behind it this one says welcome to our happy crazy fun loving home and this is a crazy home yes it is that is why this is crazy days of Callan but it is full of love and that is for sure so and the font is absolutely beautiful on these as well and the greenery that one's a little sparse so I might actually actually hot glue some flowers around the greenery on this one really really pretty and I thought that those were so extra cool and fancy and then I found this sign this really really beautiful sign so this says farm fresh happiness and I love that little wooden dowel kind of like rod right up at the top and I love the gingham print of the ribbon really fun and I like the shape of it as well so I love the word happiness and that is just just a really nice sign and I also liked it paired with those other two that I showed you first so picked those up and that is exciting so found that all first and foremost and I absolutely loved it then I want to show you the prettiest yarn I think I have ever seen them produce from Crafter Square so this is for Mumsy she loves to read and she also loves to knit so this is Crafter Square color pop yarn it's 1.76 ounces and this beautiful mint color is so completely gorgeous and lovely with all of those speckles through it so I picked up that one then I picked up the pink one one with like the hot pink speckles on it so those are gonna all look so beautiful together even if she did it in like a pattern where it was um stripes and that is gonna be just beautiful for like a small little throw for the back of the couch or something this one is blue but it has like orange and darker blue speckles throughout the yarn and then this one is an off-white it's an off-white with yellow and green running through it as well. So very, very beautiful. And then lastly, this one is almost like a tannish peach color, but it has purples and pinks running through it. So I cannot wait to see what she comes up, crafts, and creates with all of that really fancy, dancy, nice, nice stuff. So I picked those up and that was extra happy for me. Now, before we get too far off the kitchen stuff, I forgot I had stuff on my leg here. I did find this beautiful towel and I did see that they had a whole dishware line out with this pattern on it. So I think it's really, really pretty, but I didn't want all the dishes, but they have the glasses, the mugs, the plates, the, um, you know, the placemats, everything that you can think of. But I really loved this to just throw over my oven handle. This says every flower blooms at its own pace. And I loved the saying of it too that's on here. 
So I scooped this one up and this one just simply says kitchen towel. So I will put that up in probably like the summer months. I love that nautical, you know, blue and the white. So it can go up really cute with all the patriotic stuff. And then I found these and I've actually never seen them do this before. So this is um, from Home Collection and this is dishcloths. And there's a two pack of these. So they are printed. And they seem to have a really nice scrub side to them. I do want to take this apart so that we can see what one of the cloths look like at least. And look at this. I love it. And now that mimics some other patterns that I've seen on some other dishware items. But these are great dishcloths to do your dishes with. It says life is um, meant to be lived. And yes, it sure is. So I absolutely think that that is so incredibly pretty. And I love that there are two of them in there for that $1.25 price. So what, what to that? Now, okie dokie then. Let's keep moving and grooving, my little sweethearts. I found some great new uh, crossword puzzle books. And these one have movie themes. So I thought that that was really awesome. And this says $4.99 right here up in the corner this says stars of the screen large print word search i do prefer myself my mom prefers it as well a large print puzzle book so this is nice big and thick and it has all kinds of puzzles and the answer key inside of it so i grabbed this one and some of the words it says is um just actors and actresses name it says cheney swanson it says lancaster um stage door tight spot it just says all kinds of things related to movie making and characters so i picked them up and it's a volume one and volume two so there was only the two of them and I picked them both. So there is that. Another great option for some word search um, little puzzles and we love to do those. So I grabbed both of those. I did find this and I purchased this well a while ago, months ago, and I really enjoyed it. So I was happy to see it back. This is the scrub free, 20% free glass cleaner, windows, mirrors, and plexiglass furniture with a foaming action. It's 12 fluid ounces and it works really awesomely. I did my windows. I did all kinds of stuff with this. It lasted a really long time. And so I can't wait to use it again. It says 20% more for the bonus size. So loved that a lot. Then I picked this up and I actually picked this up probably like two weeks ago and I kept meaning to haul it, but it kept falling to the back of me, the side of me. And the only reason why I'm showing it to you now is I just found it in another store. So I know that they could be trickling around. I usually pre-record um, if I'm going to a week at a time. I never really go beyond that because I want you guys to find the things that I find hopefully around the time that I haul them. But this is still out and about. So here it is now. I did find this last year. I used it and it worked really good. This is Pick Pest Free Living Fruit Fly Trap. That's what it says. It says just add fruit right on the front. Now these you just take out, as you can see, the package ripped in, you know, all the weeks that it's been roaming around that I keep forgetting about. You take the lid off, put some fruit in it. It will attract the bugs and you just set it down so that they'll leave you alone while you're eating. I brought these to camp with us and everything and it did the trick. So I honestly always just put a little bit of food remnants away from us when we eat, when we're outdoors so that the bugs can go elsewhere instead of bothering us. But that cup really does a nice job. So I picked it up. I definitely did. And I was happy about it. I was happy to see it back. So right here, I grabbed these glasses. This is light up glasses. Okay. And this is for ages three plus. They are so cute. They have an on and off switch. And then look at what they do. So there is that mode, that mode, and then it turns off. So you click them three times. And those would be just really nifty, fun, and cute for the patriotic time that is coming up really relatively soon. So love those. I just thought that they were too cute to boot. So I wanted to grab those in case one of the kiddos that we're with wants to wear them if we're going to see the fireworks. So, so I grabbed that. Then I found these. 
I found these and I am going to take them out of the package. So I've already started to open them up. This says a two pack of traveling bottles. So excuse the crinkle crinkle. So this is what it looks like for these two bottles. They're adorably cute. They're, they're just the normal size that most of the traveling bottles come in. But I love the patterns and the design on them. So this one is a little spritzing bottle. You could even make a hand sanitizer at home and put it in this. Put it in your purse and use a homemade hand sanitizer if you wanted. And then this one has like a pop top. So that you can put like soap in there or whatnot. Sometimes when I go into restrooms in the public, sometimes their soap is not filled up. And I've found that quite often over the last couple of weeks of traveling. And it's kind of kibbied me out a little bit. So I'm probably going to use them for a hand sanitizer and soap. That's why I mentioned it. Just so that just in case of emergencies i can have my own supply ready for me so here is this one too with the purple flowers and i just love i just think it's so pretty and you know very useful stuff very useful happy stuff so i grabbed that as well now okie dokie my little smoky pokies i found more paper and you know what i'm not mad about it I am certainly, certainly not mad about it. Look at how beautiful these books are. So this is um, features 120 lined inside pages. And I will show you right here that you just take that little band off that will use as like a separator so that you can keep your place in the book. And then this is the one that I will open just to show you that it's just white lined pages and there's 120 of them. So I love this, but I especially love the design that they did on every single one. This one says, write it down now, deal with it later. And I love that. Because sometimes I prioritize on what's most important and what can be done later on. So that will be the official book for that. And so there is that one. Then I found this one in the same little bin. It says great ideas. And I love the little rainbow up top with the gold flex, the like the gold metallic look through it. And I love the rainbow print of the swirlies in a row. So picked this one up as well. And then I picked this one and I absolutely just love, loved, love that blue and the white pattern on it. So I thought that that was really incredibly beautiful and it has the gold and it says notes in gold. So I grabbed that and then I scoop de duped this one right up and it has such a beautiful, beautiful print. And my friend Vanessa, this looks just like her, just like the patterns that she loves. So I'm gonna gift this one to her. So I hope she loves that. And then I love this one as well. This one says, never give up. And so I'm gonna write down all of my bucket lists and things like that for 2024 that I wanna continue trying to get to do and to adventure to. So I'm gonna use this book for that and I love the floral design underneath the wording. And then I love this one because of all the pastels and the way that they designed it with that sunshine look. And this one says, every day is a new beginning. And yes, it is. So that is great. So I could wake up in the morning, write down all of my hopes and dreams for the day, all of my prayers and my thankfulness. And that is going to be a great way to start the day. So I scooped de duped that right up. Now, 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 now I found this great book. I found this great book and I cannot wait to dive into this. This is totally like up my alley for what I like. It says The Nanny. Um, and this is dark, twisty, and full of characters you will love to hate. New York Times bestseller. It's a paperback book. And this book went for $9.99 originally. And it says a breakout thriller is a dark, twisted version of D Downton Abbey gone very, very wrong. So that is what this is. And look at how thick and big that book is. So I've been back into reading a lot more frequently lately. And I can't wait to dive into that and see where that takes me. So what, what to that? That's exciting stuff. I did a little, I did a little ding, ding, ding. You know, things are rolling and twirling all over the place around here. I did find some new decorations out in the beach theme stuff from the Shore Living line. And I loved this one. 
Now they had a bunch of different ones that said things. I think there were another two maybe, but I just simply loved the one that said beach. And I love how they did the rope on this really cute little wooden piece that can stand up on its own, or you can hang it up by these two little hanging mechanisms right there. So I picked that one and I thought it was absolutely cool and lovely. I also grabbed this beautiful can, uh, little lantern. Candle holder is what it says, but it has this little metal hanger right there. So you can put a beautiful little um, candle in there. Not Maybe not even an actual burning candle, but one that is, you know, a switch on and switch off candle that you can use a battery with. And I just absolutely love the glass. It feels really cool. I love the texture of it and that very, very intense aqua blue. So very, very beautifully done with that one. And I think that that whole line that they came out with this year was even better than when they first released it. I, that's just my opinion, but I think they did a really good job with it. Now, I did find some other things in that line as well, and I thought that these were beautiful. I can never get enough of all of the beading little decorations. I love the things with the beads on it. So I picked this one up, and it's different than the original ones that I picked up and hauled for you guys a couple of months ago, or at least a month ago or so. And it has these little plaster pieces that are definitely breakable, so just be careful. And I absolutely love the details that they did on that seashell so there's all the beads it's nice and long and I especially love the little tassel that always hangs from the end here is the really beautiful gorgeous sand dollar and I just have an absolute love for sand dollars usually when I go to the beach I can find at least three sand dollars and the number three is very significant for me so I always feel very connected at the beach like somebody and a lot of people that I love and have gone you know to home in the sky um are with me sorry it just makes me a little sad really quick thinking about it but I feel very connected to everybody at the beach up above is what I'm trying to say so right here is this beautiful starfish I absolutely think she is lovely and gorgeous and the detail is magnificent so I picked up all three of those and those are brand new then right here this is crafter square and this is a burlap little piece of fabric. This is the 18 by 21 inches of fabric. And it has sand dollars all over it. So my favorite. And I'm going to use this to craft and do some really cute beach crafting and decorations with. So that is just pulled out a little bit, not even all the way. And 18 by 21 inches usually gives you a decent amount of fabric. So loved that. And I thought it was jazzy fresh. Now let's see where we're going here. We got to get a little responsible around here. Yes, we do. We have to do some adulting. <laughs> so here we go with some Ajax. Now I always keep waiting for the 16 fluid ounces to come back because I love to find the 16 fluid ounces. And now now all I can find close to that is 15.2 fluid ounces of the Ajax, but that's still a better buy at 125 at the Dollar Tree than if I was to go to Market Basket, Shaw's, uh, Walmart, or what have you for even a size that's around here. It would be more than that. So this is Ajax, fights grease and stuck on stains, citrus scent and salt, which is cool. And um, I just, I love it. I love those bigger bottles and they do up my dishes quite lovely. This is the 15.2 fluid ounces as well. And this is sparkling clean dishes. And this is the lime scent in vinegar. And I love cleaning with vinegar. I absolutely do. I always have. And so that is a hit for me because that is such a great um, degreaser and everything else keeps things nice and fresh. So I picked that up as well. Now let me feel around because you know I got some things. I found this wonderful, wonderful little glass um, tumbler here. Does it specify tumbler? Um, jar with lid and straw is what they say. Now I found this with the blue tint to it, but here is just the regular plain old glass. And I like that 
because the rest of them I used actually to house seashells and sand dollars inside of them and they look so pretty and I'm going to set them out for beach decorations but this one I will actually drink out of because it's just the plain glass has that little wooden top right there has an amazing feel it just clips right into there so nicely and it comes with the reusable straw that you just wash so I picked that up and I'm very happy to see it then I also, for that particular um, glass little jar with lid, I did grab some little packets and I love lemon in my water a lot of times. So this is the true lemon, crystallized lemon for water, tea and recipes. There's 12 packets in here, which I think is great. Zero sugar, zero calories, unsweetened, non-GMO. So I grabbed this so that I can make some nice icy water with lemon inside of that great glass. So I grabbed it and it was exciting for me. I found some snacks and I thought that these were pretty awesome. There is that fantastic brand right there that when I was eating gummies, this was definitely bringing me a lot of happiness and satisfaction. I'm not going to say the name of it because it I don't want to say it wrong, but this says true to fruit, exotic fruits, natural flavors, okay? This is 2.5 ounces and this is a different one than what they've carried in the past. Um, this has mango, Asian pear, black currant, blood orange, crimson cranberry, uh, Fuji apple, queen pineapple, and rubus raspberry. That is what is in here and what the gummy bears each taste like. Isn't that nifty? I am going to try one of those. I am definitely going to try one of those. And then I found this bar and Isaiah absolutely loves Rice Krispies. So I picked it up for him. This is Kellogg's Rice Krispies milk chocolate candy bar. And so I'm going to give that to him for his lunch tomorrow. I have never seen them ever have that. I found this actually up by the register. So if you want to try it, maybe try it there. It was not in the candy aisle. Then, okay, I grabbed this. I grabbed this one and these came out around the holidays, but um, the jelly donut is what they came out with in this exact same packaging. But this one is brownie batter. So Dunkin' Chocolates Donut Flavored Filled Chocolates Brownie Batter Milk Chocolate Shell with Brownie Batter flavored cream filling and it has two of them in there that's a fun time that is a fun time so those jelly donut ones everybody said that I gave them to for Christmas they said that they were really good so I can only imagine how the brownie batter one tastes so I thought that that was nice and also pair with some nice coffee some really great coffee. So I had to pick up Richie's coffee this week. And this time around, I went with the Jim Bean Bourbon Vanilla. This is a four ounce bag. And he loves all of the um, offerings of what the Dollar Tree comes out with for coffee options. And this is one of his favorites. So I got four of these so that he has um, four of them. That's $5 for all of those ounces and that is way less than going and buying a can at the grocery store at the current moment. So I picked those up. He's going to be happy about that. And then last, this is not last, this is not last, <laughs> but it's close to last is what I'm saying. I found these two mugs and I had to have them for myself and my own personal excitement of just having a fun mug. So this one says, I love weekends and yes, I love my weekends. By Tuesday, I'm already like, yes, we are close to the weekend. We sure are close to the weekend. <laughs> so right here, it's double printed on both sides. Great size mug. And on the bottom, it does say dish um, washer safe and microwave safe. So I do love my weekends and I'm always planning them out well ahead of time. Then this one right here also pertains to like my mindset now that I'm getting like up there in age, mentally on vacation. I am always mentally on vacation, always. I'm always looking and planning for something to look forward to so that I can get through all the grind of every day and get to a happy spot where we're just taking downtime together or whatever we're choosing to do for a day trip, vacation, what have you. 
Now, this is last. This is last right here. This is Scrub Buddies Copper Scours. I think that these are great. And this is a three pack. It says great for cleaning tough baked on food. Ideal for uncoated pots and pans. Please wear gloves to use it, it says. And they do work really well. And I picked them up again because I saw them again. So that is it. Happy Wednesday Dollar Tree Haul. I love you guys to the moon and the stars and the sky. Thank you so much for being here with me. And if you're new here, hi, I'm Callan. I would love it if you'd stick around, stay, like, share, subscribe, comment down below. Hit the bell notification so that you are aware of every single time that I upload a new video. Here on this channel, I do Dollar Tree Hauls on Saturdays, Mondays, and Wednesdays. I'm always happy to be here with you. Thank you for being here with me as well. I will see you guys on Happy Saturday Dollar Tree Haul, and I hope you all have a beautiful, blessed, wonderful week. I love all your beautiful faces. Bye, everyone.